Yes, it's RV day. Now he's going to throw the trim back on to see if it's accurate and fits. And it does. Bada bing, bada boom. Look at that pretty. And I'm going to come in and I'm going to vinyl this. I'm going to measure out the medicine cabinet so I know exactly what I don't have to vinyl because, you know, we like to save material. So let me show you guys. On the inside of this, I'm going to unscrew this. You can vinyl this. All right. So well, do you have to unscrew it? Because I can vinyl it from there. Nope. Again, it's better for you to vinyl going flat so you could actually scrape it going along. Okay. Not only that, but then I could take this off. There's not going to be screws in here. I'm going to put wood glue. Mm. And again, that way this can dry by the time I put it on there. Okay. I know you're on the video. Uh, this is the kitchen countertop that just got done. Not all the way finished with it. I come through the hickey thing right here. And got the cabinets. You're not gonna see the top of that, but the insides of it is drying blue, just like the kitchen count. I mean, that's the bathroom sink. It's not spotty, it's just shiny. So, yeah, sinks, bathroom stuff is out here kitchen countertop with the green marble and here's the wall that I'm about to panel so I gotta measure this out and see how it goes on there no I'm going to do that measurement because I gotta make, I'm, make the measurement from the actual boards that it's gotta screw into I got that don't trip because I'm gonna have to mark it just based I'm, I'm gonna mark it yeah, that way I just know not to vinyl around that no, area. No, you go ahead and vinyl the whole thing if need be. If you're not, you're pretty much just doing everything down here, leaving this part. Yeah, that's why I wanted to measure it so I can know how far down, but okay. Well, I got a job to get to, so till next time, peace out.